deep breath and to take it all in. But but what what was it like to walk away from that one with a win? Yeah, that was obviously good. Um, the way we played them uh, up in South Bend, um, it was in the 90s. Uh, it was 93, 87. We knew we, want, we needed to keep it in the 60s. Um, and we did that tonight. Found a way to get out of there. Virginia Tech said we need to keep it in the 60s. You guys can score with the best of them, man. It was that was the game plan, huh? Yeah, we, we needed to slow them down. Um, they're obviously a great offensive team. They're very experienced, um, so we needed to slow them down offensively, play a lot better defense. Talk to me about in some of those timeouts late, some of those pressure moments. There were there were calls that were really 50-50 calls. It was ultra physical. What was it like in those timeouts and kind of going out and having to execute? Yeah, um, when, we, when we went into the media um, down five, uh, we knew we needed to lock in. I think there was 5.30 left to play um, and we knew there would be no tomorrow if we didn't lock in together. Um, Rodney Rice made a huge play defensively. Huge three, yeah. I, was gonna, I can see the scratch marks on you. It was definitely super physical. <laughs> Great job tonight. Talk about the, the poise of this team. You guys have been there before. A lot of these guys won the ACC last year. How much experience helped you in this game tonight? Yeah, we're a very experienced team, obviously, um, having having the three seniors and then Sean. Sean's been playing great all year. Um, but we have a lot of guys that have played a lot of games, um, and I think that's helpful. Um, we, we battled adversity this year. Obviously, that stretch in January yeah. um, was pretty tough, so we, we really locked in together, um, and we feel good. I know you weren't here last year, but this Virginia Tech team went on a run four games in a row to win the ACC tournament. What did, has Mike Young given you all a message from that run and kind of how to prepare to make this long run and how, what you have to do to be able to lock in to take, game, to take it game by game? Yeah, I think uh, really we, the first time we talked about it was today, and what he said was, I haven't talked about it at all. Um, and he said, uh, it's you guys that have the experience. You guys know what it's going to take. Um, you guys played a lot of games. I just need you to continue to stay together um, and trust, trust your work. Yeah, when you talk about uh, the defensive mindset and want to keep this in the 60s, how taxing is that on you all when we talk about you got to win five games in five days? How you feeling now? Going to be ready for the refresh tomorrow? Yeah, yeah, we all feel good. Um, we, we got a great uh, strength strength coach and David Jackson. He's prepared us all summer, um, all, all season. He, he, he's done a great job getting us ready. And then our trainer, Hasham, has been awesome, too. Um, we, we know what it's going to take, and, and we're ready to go. You're going to get another shot at NC State tomorrow, and I know you guys are looking forward to that. What's the key in winning that game? Yeah, um, obviously they have the, the really talented guards, um, and then uh, Burns has been playing very well inside for them. Um, we played really bad and, uh, when, when they came into our place, and they, they, they beat us pretty good. Um, and then we didn't have Hunter Couture, so he'll be back. That'll help us, obviously, but we just need to uh, stay together um, and just continue to take it game by game. Hunter's a big difference maker for you guys as well. We appreciate the time. Grant, get some rest. and looking forward to seeing what you guys are able to do tomorrow. Thank you, guys. Thanks Congratulations, so much. Thank you, man. Great job, man. Good luck tomorrow. Great stuff. All right, so Virginia Tech gets